and we are back. Sunny and beautiful day here in London on Terrible. What's up guys? How's it going? Mark from 408. We got Thai guy here too. So we swung by our most favorite store because the weather's so beautiful out today. We wanted to uh, pick some stuff up, but and maybe we'll do some car stuff. See if there's time. Maybe we'll go to McDonald's too. With Princess Auto first. See how much money we can burn. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> This is what we need for the track. We're gonna build a mud pit this year. So I'm not gonna pick it up today, but we're gonna get a nice trash pump. Make a bigger mud pit, not that stupid little puddle that we hit all the time. We're going big. <laughs> go big or go home. So maybe we'll pick her up in a month or two here. Yeah. Perfect. Do -do 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 -do. Da -da -da. What do we need? Let's get a rake. There we go. <laughs> Got some work gloves? Sure. Sure. Blue is the best color. Blue. Blue. Blue is the way to be. Oh, I definitely need some, <sighs> some rubber gloves as well. Go black. And I'm thinking an extension cord. And my favorite thing as always, some straps. We got two today. I need a tow rope. Throw a tow rope in there. Oh, two of them. <laughs> some more winches. That's a big one. Hey, imagine that on the front of the Maverick. Yeah, 8,000 pounds, that'd winch me up a tree. <laughs> All right, let's pick up a dirt bike stand as well. You can always have extras. Perfect. All right, let's get out of here. Quick chow down. Got a hero from Arby's. Curly fries, oh. the bomb. Yum. <laughs> ah. And back at the farm. What's up, guys? We are ready to rock. So decided we're going to change these studded tires out real quick. Two of them leaked. And uh, yeah, we're just going to swap them out for my normal tires. Then we're going to head down to the track. So here, that's yours. I will do that for the weekend. You. So, uh, anyways, yeah, they they do have slow leaks. Obviously, we got a full day of filming out of it before they leaked. That one actually lasted three days. This one was about 24 hours before it leaked out. But uh, these ones are still doing fine. So, but yes, yeah, so we're going to put my normal Super ATV Warrior ATs back on. So, and the best part about these tires is they're DOT approved. So, you can take them on the road. So, obviously, this thing is street legal. So these are the tires I have to run because they are DOT approved. So I'm like the old assassinators there. So let's get this thing jacked up and uh, swap these tires out and then we'll go head down to the track and see if we can have some fun. You got it. <laughs> the old half inch. No problem. Ding, 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 ding. Come on, get in there. Just like that, boom. Just some F1 here. Anybody willing to pick them up? <laughs> you hire me. You have one mechanic. There we go. Perfect. All right. Got new, uh, the new Year's Pre Warriors here. Put those on. We can start road running again. <laughs> Perfect. And they're back on. I haven't had these bad boys on in a while, but uh, yeah, good to go. We're gonna go around some streets now, see if we can go get arrested. Got them torqued to 120 pounds, and these are off till next year, so. These were absolutely amazing. So happy we did this, and we got a few videos out of them, so. Hopefully those videos do well over the year, and uh, yeah. Definitely check out Bull 8 Rims, and uh, yeah. All right, let's grip and rip it, head to the track in the rain. All right, so we've done about two or three DeWalt giveaways so far. We gave away a chainsaw, we gave away a grinder, and now we're giving away the hood light. So if you guys haven't seen this yet, it's a hood light. So basically it goes under your hood. Like these extend, you rotate, and uh, yeah, you just basically use it for anything. You can just hang it if you want to. Use it for a light. So we're gonna be doing a giveaway with this. All you have to do to enter 
is check the description below. You'll see the 408 merch page and the 408 giveaways page. Just enter your info in there. And uh, within a couple of weeks, we'll pick a winner. So good luck. And I can't wait to, uh, to do bigger and awesome giveaways. Thank you, guys. Let's head to the track. It's definitely a high-vis day today. So it's always sunny and blue skies under this umbrella. I mainly just brought the umbrella to keep the, uh, the water off the lens here. So as you can see, the, the river is up pretty high. You can't really see it through here, but the water is coming in hot. Oh, hold on to her. You almost got a soaker there. <laughs> That's how you wash the booties off. But yes, most of the snow is gone now. So no more sledding for the year. We might do some water skipping. Obviously not today because the river is a giant lake. So I don't feel like risking it and going down in 10 feet of fast flowing water. You never know what he's doing down there. Any uh, dead animals in there? Nope. Humans? Nope. Perfect. They must have floated away. <laughs> All right, let's go uh, see if we can fire something up and go for a little rip ski. It's been a while. I haven't done uh, the car videos. Well, Brad was over the other day. We did that one, but obviously it doesn't really make sense to do car videos in the winter because there's winter activities. Plus, everyone wants me to jump cars in the winter. It's like basically impossible to. It's just basically a waste of a car because it's slipping and sliding. And then if it even hits the jump, it usually just rolls over, right? So, all right. We're good. Let's set it and forget it. The old collection. We definitely got to blow up this Cadillac this year. It's time to get rid of that thing. The thing's been sitting there for a while. The Subaru, she's struggling. Flat tires, tires off the rim. Uh, the two-wheel drive Ford Escape, the all-wheel drive with the effed up tire. I think it's time for some fresh vehicles. I think we need some F-350s down here. Some bigger trucks. Some 2500s, 3500s. Oh, you can hit the puddle today. I don't know, it still looks pretty frozen. I don't even know if it'll do anything. Well, plus it's not even really deep. I see a soaker in the near future. Is that deep? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently not. Nope, you need a car through it. I guess, well, let's fire this thing up. We had her out, was that yesterday, two days ago? Go time. Should fire right up with the old NOCO here. This thing's probably gonna need some fuel soon. Oh yeah, some raw ponies. Oh yeah, good luck seeing out of that. <laughs> no fluid. All right, go time. Look at that tire. Oh my God. Still looks like it's all wheel drive. Oh, we got to turn off traction control. Ty! Turn off traction control and then put it in reverse. It's right in the middle in front of this shift up front there. On the dash in front of the shifter. Low dash, low no. Keep going forward, yeah, right there. But yeah, go in reverse or you're gonna slide onto this puddle and you might be gone forever. I'm definitely not bringing my truck in here today. She's sitting at the gate. I do not feel like cleaning that thing. <laughs> uh, give her some beans. Let her fly. This thing doesn't want to run. Did we break it yesterday? There it goes. <laughs> she does not like to today. What's going on in there? We'll press it. Maybe. Usually I just pressed it and it would turn off. Yeah, it was working. Alright, you good? That's weird. 
We're gonna have to pull the fuse. Is it still coming on? Yeah. Hey, let's pull the fuse. Pop the hood. So we just pulled the ABS fuse. Hopefully that uh, gets it done. I pulled another one by accident and the whole thing shut off. So, all right, let's see how this works. Well, you we might as well just try it. Throw in reverse. Oh yeah. The old ABS fuse. Don't need it where we're going. We should jump this thing backwards again today. Now that there's zero front suspension, Let's see if we can just rip that old tire right off. <laughs> she does not want to turn. Oh, don't slide in there sideways. Oh, oh nice little bounce. He is muddy today, holy. Well, hopefully you can get some speed on the way back. Because if that thing pops in there, we're done. That's it for the day. We do have one more idea for later though. I'm not gonna tell you guys. It involves something. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. <laughs> it's tracking, it's not getting much speed. That thing does not like to turn anymore. Let's see how it's here. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Made it! Almost got me. Just had to warm up the turbo. She's running good now. <laughs> the front tire is just locked. Locked in there. Zero suspension. Too much fun with old vehicles. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can jump this thing backwards. <laughs> or if he's just stuck now. <laughs> Looks like both front suspensions are locked. Just crushed. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. So soupy. Yeah, there's a big rut over there. Everything likes to get stuck in. There you go. He's on it. I think we'll be able to jump this thing backwards today. Zero traction. Just a big old suit pit. I think the tire's getting worse. What do you guys think? Hard to tell. A lot of steam. <laughs> oh man. Uh oh. That's a, that's a super soupy spot right there. Is it going to be able to get out? Oh yeah, let her dance.
roasting some tires. Yeah, can you get back to where it was parked? I'm trying. Sounds like it's getting hot. Is it getting hot? Is she getting hot? Uh, it's all right. It's all right. Yeah, okay. That tire. She looks dead. chilly out here today. I can't believe it was 16 degrees yesterday. That's like plus four today. Well, we tried. I think we need another week or two before we really got into the car stuff. Well, how was that? That was a little bit terrible. Yeah. <laughs> you, you can turn it off. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think we'd even be able to jump it backwards today. It's a good way to burn some rubber. Yeah. Probably just burnt out our box of fuel. <laughs> but yeah, everyone wants to use me to jump these in the winter and this time of year. It's like, you can't even go in a straight line. How are you going to jump yeah. the damn thing? <laughs> uh, all right, should we try that secret thing we discussed before we earlier? Definitely get all to right, that. See if we can blow great. our faces off? Yeah, let's do it. All yeah, right, let's go. Yeah, do the old boot clean up. I'll send my mud your way. <laughs> oh. Perks of March, the old transition season, I call it. All right, let's go have some fun. No more dunks for you. Yeah. I mean, I could lay in here. Get all the pesticides coming off the farmer's fields. Good for the skin. We just got a uh, package from FXR. I did not know this was coming. Well, I kind of did, but I kind of forgot about it, so. I didn't think it'd be coming this soon, that's for sure. Ooh, I'm already excited. What do we got? What do we got? Fresh moto gear for the summer. Look at that. Well, that's a nice light jersey. That's definitely uh, nice and breathable. Couple pairs of pants, couple couple jerseys. So I was wearing 365 gear, but they because of what's been going on, they went out of business, so I decided to switch it up for the year. So nothing too crazy, just did some black and red. But yeah, they got my name on there and everything. So thank you, FXR. I've been with them for winter gear for six, eight years now, and absolutely incredible gear, especially uh, especially the onesies. So I figured, why not? I wear the uh, the moto gear as well. So thank you. And uh, yeah, all right, let's do our other thing that we're planning on doing. Let's do it. <laughs> so this is our final idea of the day. I saw this on Instagram. They didn't really explain how they did it, but it was aggressive. So you take a bigger water bottle, half full of water, and you take butane and fill it full of butane, and then you just flip it over, and apparently it shoots off like a like a rocket. Don't try it home, and the yeah. cameraman's going to stand far away. Yeah, maybe stand behind me. <laughs> oh, man. We'll see how good this works. Oh, oh there was, there's a little bit to it. Had pressure. Yeah, maybe I need a lot more. What an idiot. Of course I need a lot more. <laughs> oh, that's just good there. It was, yeah, it was I getting there. All right. More water, more butane. I have a different brand of butane too. I'll try that. All right. Round two. I got some M Zone Ultra Premium. It's got to be good. Premium. It's, it's got to be good. Yeah. 12 bucks a liter. Alright. Alright, I hate things that you can't control. <laughs> <laughs> well, that one didn't work. Okay, Did not premium it. does not work. This must be junk butane. Alright, one more go. I'll grab some uh, more water again. And then after that one more go, we're going to do it with the cap. I'm going to put the cap on, just throw it. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently you need a lot. All right, we're gonna cap this one. <laughs> you pressurized pretty good. <laughs> it's rock solid. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
So apparently you need a lot of butane. Pretty much the whole tank, eh? Yeah. We'll try once more to wrap it up. Put the cap on. Whoa! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Always good to end on a good note, eh? Yeah, so this is this is Woods Butane. I'm sure there's a million different brands. Obviously that white can didn't work at all, but and yeah, you just dump as much as possible. They were using two liter water bottles too. I think that's only a liter and a half. So I don't know, first time trying it, but that worked. Not so bad. pretty cool. But uh, we'll definitely have to try it again. We'll use a a water cooler jug next time. Exactly. How about that? <laughs> oh man. Need like uh, probably like five balls of butane. Butane, yeah, exactly. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Don't do anything I would do. Make sure you follow Ty on Instagram. Here, I'll, I'll switch her around here. Back to the camera. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I mean, feel free to try that at home. <laughs> Just go outside, away from cars. Don't aim at anybody. Yeah, wear safety glasses. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys again. We'll see you later. Bye bye.